Okay, so it's good there, right? Yeah. Doing the thumbnail first? Don't. Yeah. Got our little thumbnail. eyes over here. Yes, let me just put everything right here. Para que se vea deli deli. Then for a bow. Just saying yes, mom. What's up, mom, y'all? No lo puedo, ¿verdad? Trying to be a fat ass. <laughs> Oh. Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to another video. So today we have just say I don't even think I need an introduction. I anymore. know, no key, point. huh? And uh, now we feel like it's my channel. Uh, you guys already know who she is, okay? There's no need for me to tell you guys, but anyways, today we are gonna be filming a basically it's gonna be a seafood boil mukbang slash story time of how we met we're gonna be giving you guys basically our points of view so she's gonna give you guys how she remembers it and i'm gonna give you guys how i remember it because i feel like it's you know gonna be like okay two different people two different points of views and just to let you all know i got like a dory brain like i have like short-term memory yeah. loss at some point or something cause... girl honestly so we'll see how this turns out because yeah I don't know. Y'all <laughs> are gonna be thinking yeah. that we're lying to you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but honestly, I feel like I don't really remember a lot of how we remember, or at least I don't remember the specific date. But I no. do remember like a little bit how we kind of started talking. Anyways, okay, do you want to let them know what we got? We got boiling crab. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so we got um, boiling crab. Um, we got a couple of fries here. We're gonna show you guys all we got right now. And then we also, of course, had to pair it up with a little, you know, a little chelada. I got the piña picante. This is the one I got. Delicious. And you? I got mango, mango y chile. Mm -hmm. Fire. So, yeah. Obviously, if you're not overage, please do not drink. We do not <laughs> condone underage drinking, so please drink responsibly, okay? That is my little disclaimer. Um, but yeah, anyways, let's pull out our stuff. Let's show them what we got. Okay. They're the same thing, honestly. We got the Bam! Ooh. Bam! Wow. Dude, I'm so ready to eat. We haven't eaten. But anyways, let's dig in. We're going to go ahead and get started with the story time on how Jasenia and me met. Let me pop my little chalada open because how am I going to open it with greasy fingers, you know, and chile. Ooh. Cheers, friends. Oh. I was like, I can help you. <laughs> I'm learning. She with a nails. bad bee because she opened it with nails. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Oh, it's so good. This is bomb. Mm, that's exactly what we needed. So I'm gonna make my little concoction over here. Same. This concoction. Did you come up with this or no? I saw it. I think on YouTube somebody oh, was okay. eating it. They were like, "You're supposed to mix the lime with the salt and pepper." And I was like, "Oh, I had no idea." But first time I ever went with Angie to go eat, and she did this, I was like, "Oh, this is like, bomb." I got to do it. I know this is bomb. Yeah, but basically, just squirt your lime into this little container that they give you, and you basically make a little like dipping sauce, you could say. For your shrimp, I got green, green, green tomatoes, 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 tomatoes. You're alive! <laughs> That's literally what I was thinking in my head. Okay, you ready? You ready for the story time? See. Si. Okay. Do you want to do your point of view first or me? I want to try a fry. <laughs> okay, let's try some fries. Cheers. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do a little first taste test of this camarón. I usually dip it into the chile, and then I dip it into the juice. Of the lime. Ooh. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. I hate that I have nails. Mm -hmm. It's like. I would hate that too. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't oh, have It sucks to be you. Okay, sorry. I'm gonna bite these nails off. Mm. See, this is why I wear a bib. I already freaking got Girl. it. Ooh. Oh my god, you know what's my favorite? The salchicha. Oh, oh, me too. <laughs> I'm like, oh, me too. I love I salchicha mean. weenie. Mm. My favorite. Oh my god, it's so good. Okay, I got a part of the camaro now. <laughs> but some already doing in. Mm-hmm. Excuse us guys, we gotta get oh at least the first camaro in. It's low-key spicy. Do you taste it? Oh no, I didn't dip it in the the Oh my god, it's low-key spicy. Mm -hmm. My mom was spiced that already. Mm hmm mm, So good. Okay. You got your little try already? The way you can start with my little story time or whatever? Mm-hmm. Okay. So I think I'm going to start off with my... <gasps> Wait, what happened? I don't know. I was going to freak out. I was like, I had to 
ain't getting no sausage. sausage. <laughs> That's my favorite. We're gonna go ahead and get started. I think I'm gonna give you guys my point of view of how I... Not that I think how we met, but that's how I recall it, okay? Because I'm not, like, like I said, I don't freaking remember, like, a lot. Mm -hmm. But this was back in the good old days. When so, before COVID, we're right? going to go take it all the way back to 2018. Mm -hmm. Okay, and hold then, on, hold on. Let's go back. Because I'm I'm a little confused. Hold on. I'm sorry. We're going to start this one. <laughs> oh, I thought it was hard. <laughs> We got some technical difficulties, you guys. Just saying, I got the chili. <laughs> okay, I'm back, scared guys. Scared me. <sighs> okay, we're ready again. I literally saw that shot like shoot <laughs> into my eye. I was not like, was it from the camera? Yeah. <gasps> oh my mm -hmm. god, I'm scared now. Well, it's just me. Remember last time that we ate at the other place? I was all splattered. Oh yeah, yeah. You're it's right. Just me. I'm you just... eat like a child. <laughs> Thick as the nails too. No key. Yeah. Okay. Carrying on. <laughs> Carrying on after the quick um you know malfunction over here with your <laughs> So basically back in 2018, let me give you guys a little like come see the back see the background? No, back flashback? Flashback? I don't know. Girl, I don't know, whatever. I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of like a rundown. before, yeah, like a rundown of before like even meeting her, you know, before she came into my life. Mm -hmm. Changed my life forever? <laughs> But anyway, okay, 2018 is, you know, literally January. It was January 2018. I was, like, kind of thinking, like, what am I doing with life? I had just graduated high school, like, kind of, like, the year before. So I was kind of like, what am I going to do with life? Like, you know, whatever, whatever. And so then um, I was pushed to, like, either do dental assistant or be a medical assistant. And I was like, girl, which one pays more? You know, I asked the little, what was his name? Like, the advisors? Mm -hmm. Right? Is that what they're called? And so, basically, I asked which one gets paid more, and they were like, dental, but then I was like, I don't want to be in people's mouths, so I was like, you know what, I'll just do the medical assistant, fuck it, like, I'm gonna just do it. So, what was the point so of that? that's... <laughs> I know, in a way, it's just, I was kind of like, okay, am I gonna go towards something that gives me more money, or am I just gonna do something I like, basically? Yeah. Right? So, that's the lesson here, do what you love, okay? Yeah, you think about it in the long run. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I thought about it in the long Long-time. run, and I was like, no, I don't know. <laughs> For real. I know, and then, look, here I am. <laughs> you too. Anyways, um, yeah, so then um, I ended up going and I like enrolled in all the medical assistant stuff or whatever. The school was um, UEI College. It was just a trade school, huh? Yeah. It wasn't, it wasn't nothing like crazy. But anyways, it's like a nine-month pro program or whatever. So yeah, I went there and then I started January and then she came in February, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I came in January. I was there for a whole month before she came in. And I started with like other girls. Like every month you get new students kind of. Um, and then from what I can remember is that we used to do vitals, right? So you, if you guys don't know, if you guys are in the medical field like we are, <laughs> vitals is, I know, vitals is basically when you take their temperature, you know, when the medical system brings you into the like little room or whatever, um, and they take your temperature, what is it, temperature, oxygen, height, weight, and what else? Blood pressure. Blood pressure, yeah. And then you basically check if they have any allergies to medication, any new meds, whatever. You know, all that little shebang, whatever. And so we were, we would do that, like, during class. And then I met a couple girls. And long story short, we used to be four musketeers, okay? <laughs> we used to be the four musketeers, okay? I'll put a picture here if I find a picture of, like, us four. That's how we started off the year, basically. So we ended up just partnering up sometimes. I used to partner up with another one of my friends, like, all the time. And then she used to partner up with another one of our friends, right? And then we would just kind of switch off, you could say. Like, we'd be like, okay, next person. And I would go with the other girl. And then she would go with, like, the other girl. And that's how, kind of, you could say, we met and started talking. And then we would just fuck around in class, like, all day long, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, okay, we would just, like, play around. Like, just be talking. I'll, I'll insert videos and photos if I have them. Of, like, when we would just play around and stuff. But, yeah, that's exactly how I remember, like, meeting her. But how do you remember it? Well, don't even get me started. I'm just mm -hmm. kidding. Mm, basically the same. Mm -hmm. Cause that's how we met. Through school. <clears throat> Angie and another one of our friends, um, mm -hmm. like I should mention, they were in there a month before me and uh, the other friend. Mm -hmm. So they kind of paired up. Cause you had to start like basically you start off in pairs, right? You mm -hmm. get somebody and you check their vitals. So she paired up with, like I mentioned, our friend. 
And then I met, I'm partnered up with our other friend. Mm -hmm. And then after, once we took each other's vitals, then we kind of switched up. We got like the four, like all of us. And so then, yeah, that's basically how we kind of like started talking, hanging out around each other. And then um, we don't really, really remember like what the schedule was like, but we do remember it was like from 8 to 12, like every, not every day, but I, I don't know. I can't say the days. I don't remember. Um, but we would see each other like, you know, most of the week, you could say. And then eventually we kind of started like just talking and like figuring out like, oh, I live here. I live there. You know, like you used to live what? In Esco. In Esco? Mm hmm And then, oh yeah, you're right. Oh yeah, so we, we both lived in Esco and we figured one of our friends lived like Far, 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 like far, far We're like, girl, what are you doing all the way over here? Yeah <laughs> And then the other one lived far too, low-key, like 30 minutes out What was your first like impression of me? And I'll give you what's mine, I'll tell you right now Like without knowing each other, just the first impression, the first like, oh let me take your vitals, blah 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 mm -hmm. I felt like you were like standoffish mm -hmm. Like straight to the point Like like let's just get this over with uh -huh. like i'm not here to make friends like just do my thing oh. like that was the very first interaction yeah. <clears throat> okay what about okay. you with me mm. hold that thought <laughs> honestly i feel like when i met you met you like for sure that we started talking to you i thought you were a little weird <laughs> I am. <laughs> you were like, I feel I feel like you were like two quiet vibes too. Mm -hmm. And then eventually you started like warming up more and then like, you know, I understood that you were a little ratchet and I was like, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's not my vibe, you know? Low key, Low key huh? Yeah. Yeah, but you were very like, to yourself too. Like you kind of did never told nobody anything about your secret mm -hmm. life, you know? Not your secret <laughs> life, but you know? Like your my, relationship, my, my private life. your private life. Basically, yeah, all of mm -hmm. that. Like I remember you wouldn't say much. And then eventually, you kind of like started just telling us more about your life you know like more into mm -hmm. all of that you know and then we were at low key oh my god i don't know if this is weird but do all girls do this but we used to talk a lot about sex <laughs> <laughs> right yeah. <clears throat> yeah. we'd be like we had other friends right the the, the other two musketeers ah. i mean we're still cool you know i'm not saying we're not friends they're just like you know they got they got their busy lives like one of them is like a whole ass mom of three like that's insane to me like cool congratulations you know like her babies are so cute <clears throat> yes they, they really are literally like yes they are you know but it's like you know like she has a whole ass different life over there and then the other one she has a whole ass little baby too her mom her baby's cute too. yeah how old is he like one already huh like a, a year and a half yeah mm-hmm yeah so she has one baby she has her whole ass life over there too you know mm-hmm so no shade no tea or nothing like mm -hmm. that but it's just like you know we got busy lives everybody got their own lives going well, on well they got busy lives I yeah honestly we don't everyone has kids but me mm -hmm. you have one i have my one. friend has one and then the other friend has, has three. three that's insane yeah. when i think of three i'm like what the oh mm -hmm. um, but hey congrats to her because i could never like that's so many kids for me like i, I oh my god i could barely handle one girl you're like, I can barely handle myself. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, anyways. Um, yeah, we would just talk a lot. And then we would just cheese mostly out all the time. I feel like that's what it became. Mm -hmm. You know, like we would cheese mostly out, cheese mostly out. And eventually we started hanging out outside of, like, um, school, right? Yeah. Hey, were you there when we did the POF profile? Or was that with, um, not with you? Not the I was there, but I wasn't really involved. No? Like, you guys would just tell me what was going on behind the scenes, what you guys were doing. Mm, okay. Cause it was you, mainly, uh -huh. and, like, the friend you, you started the month with. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Yeah, so this one time, very quick story time. <laughs> Dude, this is hilarious. Oh, my God. This we, one did, time, we, were, we were doing some stupid stuff. Mm-hmm. We were just crazy. <laughs> For what? Like it's because we were all young and just didn't care. Mm -hmm. and like we're like bullshitting life. Mind you guys, at that time I was eighteen. No, nineteen. Girl, I don't remember. I was eighteen or nineteen. One of those two. I was how old like, were you? Oh, I was eighteen. Yeah. 18? How old were you? I was like twenty-three. Three. Dang, we were all young. 23. Yeah. Yeah, so you could already think what our lives were revolved around, going out, partying, drinking. That was the vibe back mm -hmm. then, girl. 
don't tell me that it's not because it is mm -hmm. <laughs> so we were just going crazy doing all of that um and then i remember this one of one of my friends the girl that i started with the girl with the three babies you know who you are eh? <laughs> if, you're watching, your girl. <laughs> right, if you're watching you know who you are we had great times in school okay so um i remember she was like oh let's like make a fake like <laughs> let's make a fake um dating app account or whatever and i was like sure why not so this girl ends up putting a different name but my photo <laughs> on the profile and she had it on her phone right and i was like girl whatever i don't care you know like it was whatever it was more to like have fun she was like yeah let's just talk to these guys like whatever they you know like let's just like troll them or whatever we're like sure why not so yeah. we ended up like starting the whole account and everything girl tell me why there's this one man right he was like old old <laughs> like 50 probably he starts hitting up like you know that girl on her phone but it was technically my profile what was my name veronica or something i don't even remember <laughs> but anyways this guy was over here texting her saying like oh my god you're so beautiful like i want to take you out he acted like he was rich he was like i want to take you out let me take you out shopping and blah 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 and i was like boy shopping let me bring a friend <laughs> So we were like, okay, like, let's speed up. And so we ended up, basically the long story is that technically we made the whole profile. We talked to this guy and this guy was talking to us like almost every day, if that. And so then finally we told him, let's prank him and tell him to meet us at a house, at my house, right? So we ended up giving him a whole ass random address. <laughs> who knows who lived there? I'm sorry, whoever lived there. But we gave him an address and we're like, hey, meet us here at this time. This man seriously drove from... I think he used to live in National City. Oh, damn. Yeah, he lived in National City. Like, mind you, we live in Escondido, okay? Or at least I lived in Escondido. And we gave him an Escondido address. This man drove from National City to Escondido just to meet, quote-unquote, the girl right there. And I was you. like... <clears throat> well, yeah, me. It but, was your face. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, technically to meet me. But, I mean, I was not going to show up. Hello. So we decided to hop in, in my car. I think it was my car or my friend's car. We hopped in one of the cars and we went and spied on this guy until he arrived. We're like in the car chilling, waiting for, you know, him to show up. And we're like, hey, where are you? Where are you? And he's like, I'm pulling up. And he's like, where do I park? And we told him in the front, park in the front. Of, and he's like, okay, I'm getting off. We see this man get off, girl. And he's like, old as shit. He's literally like 60 almost. He told us, told us he was 30. And we were like, oh, hell nah. We booked it out of there. We left. We left and that guy kept hitting us up saying like, hey, you know, like, like, why did you do that to me? I wanted to meet you, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, boy, get the fuck out of here. Y'all were about to be victims. Dude, I know. Well, that fake profile chick, mm -hmm. that Veronica was about to be a victim. Mm -hmm. Honestly. I remember when I pulled up with the Prius to school for the first time. Girl, I was so embarrassed. <laughs> I hated Priuses forever. <laughs> like, I, I always hated them. And I remember I, I got made fun of for having a Prius. <laughs> By that other friend with the one baby. You know who you are. <laughs> With the one baby she would be like girl what the fuck is that and i was like uh it's a prius <laughs> you're like it, it's good on gas though yeah yeah basically and i would take that car drifting in the parking oh lot i think God. i have a video of that no but it's just be like ah! I think so in the too. back of the car everybody's over here like moving and i'm over here driving like hold on bitches <laughs> why would we do we literally would do like donuts in the parking lot <laughs> Cool. Like people mm -hmm. would look at us and we're like, all right, we need to get, we need to stop before we get expelled from here. Yeah. Oh my god, I remember. Mm. But now, I remember one time in my car too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought I was cool. I was well, like I was driving all crazy, mm -hmm. <laughs> and then I hit the curve, like coming in. Oh my god! And I was yes. Like, Boom! Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I had you guys all in the back. And, and we're all in like, there. We're like, oh shit, just in here. Are you good? Oh my god. wheel, my wheel. <laughs> and then once school ended. We kind of just all kept in touch like we had this well we still have a group chat we have a group chat of like well we would just talk to each other and be like oh let's hang out let's go like we would literally just go to the beach and drink yeah remember we would just hang out like we wouldn't drink like oh my god get fucked up we would just take a couple like tall cans like this or trulies whatever it was and we would just like hang out and talk and chill and like you know that was our night mm -hmm. but yeah that's basically how we met you guys and like low-key now recently as of recently kind of like what last year we <laughs> kind of got together like a lot more huh like you yeah. and me yeah, right now that you said that i remember i have a video what of um our friend twerking <laughs> oh <laughs> my god at the beach i have it too yeah <laughs> she was so funny i literally have that it girl too. was wild 
Mm-hmm. Was just funny. She was a good time. Well, yeah. she is. Well, she is. Yeah, yeah, she, really. I'm sure she still is, you know, but it's mm-hmm. just like, like I said, we don't, you know, we all have our own lives now. We mm-hmm. we live like kind of far from each other too. We're the only ones that live here in Escondido. Mm-hmm. Um, the other two, like, they still live far. Um, they live out of town. Yeah, basically. I'm sorry if I'm, have, do I have food all over my face? I feel like I do. No, you just have a little lipstick down here. Um, what else? Mm-hmm. That was that. That was that. That's how we met. I know. And now we just always hang out. You guys see mm-hmm. us always like hanging out, chilling. We and in case if you guys, everywhere. sorry. No, I'll go I was like, in case if you didn't know, we are not in the medical field. <laughs> oh, mm-hmm. that did not work out, girl. Mm-mm. I feel like <clears throat> I feel like that's a whole another story for another time. Because well, it's only one of our friends that stayed in the medical field, huh? Yeah, the one with the one baby. <laughs> with one baby. So no. we all swore we were going to be medical mm-hmm. assistants for life and shit. We were like, yeah, we're doing this. It's going to be our career forever. If anything, we'll all work together in the same place. Mm-hmm. We all only, one of the, only one of us stayed in it. At the end of the day, now, as of recently, only one. Only one out of the four musketeers stayed. Can you believe that? Like, she's still working in the medical field, like I said. Um, doing her thing. Doing her thing. And then Killing the, it. Yeah, the other one, I have no idea what she's doing, honestly. Like, if she works or not. I think she's just being a mommy. I mean, hey, being a mom is hard, okay? Especially I can if you have three. Oh, my God, yes. Mm-hmm. Yes. Me, I'm a mom. I do DoorDash. And I'm a YouTuber, okay? Content creator. So. <laughs> I just work That's in the office. <laughs> yeah, Justinia's like... In the offices, you know, she's doing her little nine to five corporate job, whatever. So that's <laughs> where we're at now. <laughs> that's life. So who did you no. like the most, huh? Who did I like the most? Mm-hmm. From like all of us, yeah. From the three of us. Like I said, like not as a friend, but I guess like, you could be like, oh, wait, I got along with her more than you, or like you know, like that. Honestly, uh huh. You, for real? <laughs> yeah. For real? Yeah. Damn, that's because because I can't say the same. I know you can't. <laughs> I know you can't. I know who who you got along with more. Yeah. Is the is the one with that you started with? Yeah. Yeah. Fair. Mm-hmm. I miss you. <laughs> she misses you, girl. <laughs> no, for real. Um. Yeah. No. Yeah. I I think I got along with her a lot more. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Oh. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm like, I'm getting out of my house. What the hell? I'm like, I'm kidding. The, the light is hurting my eyes. <laughs> you up in my house crying over some other person? No, I'm just kidding. I'm joking. No, up. for real, she was hella fun. Mm-hmm. She's like hella crazy, hella fun. Mm-hmm. Like, still to this day, like, we're friends on social media and stuff. Yeah, and like, we post like some funny stuff mm-hmm. from this girl. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But yeah, that's my answer. The other girl. But you grew on to me. (laughs) No. I feel like we sound so like mean Mean say like yeah. No, we like oh that other girl or her other friend. Like we're not we don't want to disclose. Mm -hmm. I don't wanna drop names. Like what if they don't wanna be like, oh you know, like girl, why are you saying my name like Like, but if you guys really wanna know, go back to vlog number (laughs) just kidding. Honestly, yeah, you guys have seen them in my videos, so if you they they go way back. Yeah. Yeah. And both of them. And then last year is when we started, like I said, um, hanging out more, like us two. We would just go mm-hmm. out. I started inviting you to Tocadas. Yeah. My uncle's Tocadas, my uncle plays. Um, you guys saw, I think, a couple times. My uncle and my cousins play. They have a little grupo. Los Centenarios. Hey, go check them out. <laughs> mm-hmm. mm. They have a little grupo and stuff. So we would see, like, their little flyers, like, oh, they're going to be playing this day. And I'd be like, hey, just now you want to come through? Like, hell yeah. So she would just come with all the time. Mm-hmm. And now she's part of the family. Yeah. I and better be. Nah, for real. And then I'd be inviting you to like Thanksgiving. Family parties. Like family <laughs> stuff like that. Yeah, like I invite her to like all my family stuff in here. It's because my family doesn't really get together like that. Mm-hmm. They don't really do stuff. Es huérfana. Soy huérfana. Si alguien me quiere adoptar. <laughs> well, you basically already adopted me. Uh-huh. I feel like I adopt all my friends all the time. Yeah. You know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, low key. I love like, bringing my friends around my family. It's just my vibe. Mm-hmm. A little backstory. Right? What? I'm scared. I'm just saying. Say? What do you mean backstory? That I was, uh, I was a virgin when I met you guys. Mm. You remember? Mm-hmm. Dude, honestly, we could not believe she was a virgin. We always talk shit, to, shit about that. We would always Me talk shit. Me exposing myself? I know. <laughs> well, you were 23, so it's fine. You know? You were, I know I was she was saving herself for marriage, but... 
But that didn't work out. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. yeah, it was so crazy when you told us. We were like, <clears throat> what? A virgin? Mm -hmm. Like, we just couldn't believe it because, I mean, you know, nowadays. Mm hmm. Oh yeah, but honestly, I never thought, I really genuinely didn't think you were like, you know, mm -hmm. you had your V-card still, we were like, nah, this girl, because you would talk like freaky sometimes, <laughs> we've not, no, for real, since we were talking, right, we would have all these like, like you would like to say, we would always have talks. sex talks, yeah, we'd be like, oh yeah, like, <laughs> I'm not going to give an example, <laughs> I can't give an example, this is turning explicit, like, <laughs> I know, I'm sorry, if you guys want the full juicy details, let us know for part two, mm -hmm. There's a lot we would talk about. Or we could do like a girl talk, low-key. Yeah. But she sounded hella freaky, so we were like, there's no way this girl is like, <laughs> you know? The stuff I would say, yeah, I was out of pocket. Yeah, so that's what we were like, damn, what the hell? And you were, oh, you say you're a virgin? I'm like, sure. I was like, I'm a virgin. They're yeah. like, no, you're not. I was like, yes, We I never am. believed it, yeah. Another thing, you guys, is that at that school, we were like the girls. We were those girls. Like, <laughs> honestly, don't you think so? I feel like us four... The four of musketeers, you know? We were like those girls from the school, like like we were like the it girls. Like we were like those we weren't I'm not gonna say we were the mean girls because I don't wanna say that we were mean at school cool, because we were just kinda like this is our group, that's it, nobody comes in, that's it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, that, that's like what we I was... were exclusive, like we were literally we like, found our mm -hmm. like little group of friends, that was it. Like I'm we sorry. Clicked? Mm -hmm. Yeah. The other girls from other classes and stuff, they just didn't like us. Do you remember? Oh, I remember. Remember, we used to get always like all these ugly stares, or like they would just hate us for whatever reason. Dude, our teacher was so cool though, Mr. Oh, Mr. Rob? Mr. Rob, yes. Oh my God, Mr. Rob, if you ever see this video, I think hey. you're the downest freaking teacher, teacher ever. I'm not going to lie, you guys. Okay, we're going to just... <laughs> I hope he doesn't work there anymore. I, no, he, no he got a job at the hospital. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we know you're doing big things, Mr. Rob. Like, we freaking love you. You were the best teacher ever. But low-key, that teacher... <laughs> he let us cheat you guys he let us cheat on tests and stuff because we were not the smartest hence why we're not medical assistants anymore but <clears throat> now you were exposing our friend that still works in the medical field no but she, no, but she actually paid attention yeah. low-key she no, did she's okay smart. so she, no she's not smart. not her okay you guys don't involve her in anything like this only us that we're not in it no more yeah <laughs> no but our teacher was so cool this is how cool we were with him oh my god we went to his halloween party mm -hmm. like at yeah. his house was it after graduation? Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. it was after graduation. Nah, so. yeah, but that teacher, Mr. Rob, was fucking cool. Like, he was, like, the coolest, literally, teacher ever. But low-key, that teacher, <laughs> he let us cheat, you guys. <laughs> he let us cheat on tests and stuff because we were not the smartest, hence why we're not medical assistants anymore. Sorry, you guys, we have some technical difficulties. My camera literally died, so now we're carrying on on my phone really quick. So that way we could just come see like, finish this part of the video. Mm -hmm. But we're basically almost done eating, huh? Yeah. Yeah, we're basically we're almost done. Um, but we just want to end it off by finishing off where we were at. Where were we? Oh, how we would cheat in class. Yeah. Uh huh. Mm. Yeah, we're not part of it, but uh, we had to do what we had to do just to become medical assistants. Okay. Don't cheat, guys. Don't Honestly, cheat. now that I think about it, I wish I would have ever cheated because I feel like there was a lot, like things that they would ask me and I was like, shit, I didn't pay attention to this part of the- Yeah, life. like I should have known how to do this. Yeah, exactly. So I feel like I shouldn't have cheated. So yeah, moral of the story, do not cheat you guys because it's gonna bite it's, Yeah, it's not gonna work out in the long run. Yeah, exactly. Look at us now. <laughs> yeah, look at us now. We're mm. definitely not working in the medical field like we wish we would, mm. you know, but, or at least, I don't know. Do you still wish you would be in the no, medical field? No, not really. No? Especially after COVID. Oh my God. With COVID. <laughs> I was like, uh, good thing I'm not in the medical Honestly, field. Honestly, yeah. I literally right. stopped working in the medical field. Right before, huh? Right before, like a month before COVID hit. That's and like, crazy. that it was all over the news and yeah. everything. Mm -hmm. So I was like, mm. I don't remember when the fuck I finished, honestly, or when I stopped working at the, in the field. I think I, honestly, I worked less than a year after I graduated. And then I started doing my own thing out here, you know? But yeah, you guys, I think that's how we're gonna end the video, right? Yeah, that's all we have. I'm sorry that this video was kind of all over the place. It's because genuinely, it's been so long that I honestly did not remember exactly how we met. But that is how we basically met, and how like we kind of.
got here to the point where we're like literally filming with each other now like i know you guys love having her here so with that being said <laughs> thank you Jasenia, for being in the video once again thank you for coming. um yes i, I always freaking... love to be here <laughs> you're like whenever there's food why not uh? but with that being said you guys thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys did please give this video a huge thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe down below and turn your post notifications on that way you get notified every single time i post a brand new video thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next one bye hopefully that was good <laughs> <laughs> oh. it wasn't recording you're lying